What's up guys, got the tracks of sledge back out, got the belted guitars on it. These suckers are about worn down to uh, slicks, but it's still perfect for uh, street ripping and uh, high speed launches. Again, we're still testing out this beautiful M2C chassis right here. It should be available soon. So far it's holding up perfect. It's uh, definitely a game changer for this truck. As you can see, it's still straight from the beating it took in the last video. Uh, the M2C motor mount is now available if you guys want to check it out on the M2C website. I'll put a link in the description. Did add in some aluminum shock caps in the back. I've got the ones for the front. I just haven't put them on yet because the back is the ones that kept breaking. So uh, hopefully that's going to uh, keep these shocks together. And also, again, these beautiful Basher Queen carbon fiber towers that are holding up perfect so far. As you can see that lights the truck a little bit definitely stronger than the stock towers as you can see on the inside again the m2c motor mount along with this uh, m2c uh, esc plate right here which will fit the max 6 spectrum uh, stock esc and it's got a nice little place for the switch right there i did go ahead and install a power hd uh, waterproof 23 kilogram servo that's my go-to basher servo for years now uh, they're not the fastest in the world but they're just really tough and they hold up to the extreme bashing i did put in a little spacer right here if you can see it which is basically just a little four millimeter uh, lock nut and a longer screw because i put in this uh, arma uh, servo horn right here so everything's sat up taller but anyway we're gonna give her a quick little few blasts and see what's up Oh! Hard slap, baby. <laughs> right at the hay bale. That was a cool little front flip, too. Hopefully you can see that in camera. That was close. <laughs> kind of lost it in the sun, but got her corrected. And that was on up there. All right, guys, I threw one of 3.8 Badlands, the regular Badlands with a half inch offset. Uh, ended up blowing two of the guitars. Uh, I ran the belt of guitars on the street, and then out here in the dirt, I had regular guitars. Ended up blowing two of them, so I went and threw on these 3.8 Badlands. And this gives it a really nice stance because, again, it's got the extra half inch offset, so, it, so it's an extra inch altogether uh, width. So we're just going to play around and I'll launch off of this into that big retaining pond and uh, see what happens. Oh, 
that was a hard slap. <laughs> that thing is hitting so hard down there. All right, guys, I just had to come down here again and get this thing. Maybe kind of hard to tell in the camera with the way the GoPro distorts everything. This is a massive hill right here. It's like a damn mountain. I've already went up and down it about four times. Uh, vertically, it's at least 50 feet up in a straight vertical. So this thing's definitely taking a beating coming off of that hill. Oh, <laughs> damn girl. close all right guys that's gonna be it for another test on this m2c chassis it is well over 100 degrees right now i mean i'm just soaked with sweat right now and it's like eight o'clock in the evening it's crazy it's just it's just all i got in me right now but so far this m2c chassis still perfectly straight after all the beatings this thing has taken and huge launches especially those uh high speed street launches those things are no joke I know this thing is uh, holding together perfectly. We'll check the Basher Queen tires really quick. And cut this truck off. Oh, also I had to throw in a BLX 185 system because my um, the uh, Max 6 crapped out on me. And this is a system I already had in the toolbox. I just threw this in here. So I'm gonna have to pick up a new Max 6. This thing still has plenty of torque and power and uh, speed even with this system. You just have to be really uh, careful with the gearing. The MTC Racing motor mount, center diff mount, once again has uh, held everything together. Held the mesh together perfect, no uh, busted spur gears. And the Basher Queen tires are absolutely perfect. It's a big shout out to a Kimberly from Basher Queen once again. It's lighting the truck up and toughened it up. Uh, there's no bending in these towers and they definitely take a take a pretty harsh beating, uh, much stronger than a stock tower would. So we give a big shout out to uh, uh, M2C Racing, Basher Queen, and also Traxxas. All right guys, until next time, RC Dude 81, peace out.